Good morning everyone, I start my day with quick breakfast, nothing fancy. After breakfast, I head straight to the university. It was a little chilly, but I love morning walks. When the campus is still waking up. So this we in this video, I'm just going to tell you how I spend my whole day as a PhD student. The most requested video. And soon also I will do the question answer video and yes like my first stop was my seminar lecture as a phd student in ai attending this session is a part of routine it's where we get to discuss new ideas stay updated and sometimes get inspired for our own work once the seminar was over i made my way to the library right now I am deep into research for my PhD because my defense is coming up this month. So I'm just busy grabbing books, researching, stuff like that. Because I'm working on large language models. So these days are a bit intense. I'm focusing a lot on finalizing my chapters, organizing my experiments and trying everything together. Yeah, you can see like right now I'm just searching which book I need and which I don't. So yes, studying AI means I spend a lot of time reading papers, running models and thinking through complex problems. It's challenging, yes it's challenging, but I really enjoy the process. No sorry, I'm just kidding. Honestly, some days feel endless staring at the screen, typing, double checking every little thing, but there is a real sense of satisfaction seeing everything comes together. By the way, you know, like when you are literally work on um, models or complex model, even you were spending your one week, two week, three week, or even months, if you found error, you feel like the whole month you spend on finding errors or like removing the errors working on those errors are nothing like you if you are stuck you feel like you are stuck you need to start from scratch that is by the way very bad thing and that's i think like that's why a lot of students i know who stop their phd on a very starting step so um i even had view moments today where i i have like some codes which i found error and you know like whenever i f i feel like i need to uh remove the errors i just stop like but then yes of course i need to i need to make it progressive so those small those small steps you know like make you win and keeps you motivated by the way, like the library atmosphere really helped me to concentrate. And you know, like everyone around, when you see like everyone around is busy and working on their own dreams and goals and they are motivated in their own way. That movement, that moment literally likes, it's remind me why I choose this path, not just for the degree, but for the love of learning, exploring and the boundaries of what what we know with ai uh so yes like i think those who are studying ai or machine learning or those who are studying coding or those who are coders they they can relate and they can feel the pain i'm facing right now while working
so later i had a meeting with my supervisor and uh, there i shared some new ideas and updates about my work it always helpful to get feedback from your supervisor so right now i'm just explaining what i think i need to update or maybe add so i think in the start when you want to do phd like everyone wants to show their abstract or show the idea like too much but when you are literally working on it you face the struggle and you also face um, face so many problems so yes my advice is like on the start don't don't say like yeah you can create moon you can create star blah 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 and yes after that it was finally a rest time i took a small break yes and honestly after a long morning filled with lectures and research and meetings i really need a short break just to breathe recharge and clear my mind a little sometime during these busy days even a few minute of just sitting quietly makes a huge difference i spend some time just relaxing it's so important to find a balance otherwise everything starts feeling too robotic and after resting a bit i f- it was finally time for a lunch today i decided friend. to create myself um <laughs> like a burger let's heat it up it wasn't anything fancy just something warm comfortable that just makes me full otherwise you know like every time i just go for comfort food and after hours of focusing on my laptop and discussing heavy topics with my supervisor i felt great to just sit back enjoy my food before heading home i picked my jacket from the clock room now i'm on my way to the metro station and the time is almost 7 pm I pass by this lovely little flower shop. I buy nothing, but it always a peaceful. <laughs> so yes. I tap my metro card, and you know, like it took me uh, about forty-five minutes to get back to my dorm from my university. Like. And that's how my day ended. Another full day in the life of any any researcher filled with a lot of hard work. So yes, thanks for spending the day with me. If you enjoyed this video, like. See you in the next one. Bye bye.